A six month investigation into the deadly oil refinery explosion that killed two workers is over. OSHA cited and fined BP for violating safety procedures and failing to adequately train workers. Kaylee Marantet is live near the plant in Oregon tonight. So Kaylee, did OSHA find out how this explosion even happened in the first place? Melissa, OSHA basically found that workers were trying to control rising liquid levels in the fuel gas mixture, which resulted in a flammable vapor to form that ignited and exploded, leading to the deaths of two workers, brothers Ben and Max Morrissey. OSHA proposed for $156,000 in penalty fines for BP, which is set by federal statutes. BP was cited for what OSHA calls 10 serious violations and one other than other than serious violation. Those include things such as training operators to identify dangerous flammable oils during these conditions and to develop and implement safe practices during upset conditions, among several others. The, the penalties associated with our citations are based on federal guidelines and, and procedures that we follow in determining those citations. They're based on this, the severity of the injury and also the, the severity of the hazard. I always tell people that our citations are not designed to punish a company. They're not punitive. They're, they're there to be a deterrent to a company. So that companies do the right things up front so they don't receive the funds. BP has 15 days to comply and meet with the OSHA area director to talk about these fines and penalties and even have some room to negotiate. The union will also have a seat at that table for those conversations. In the meantime, the refinery remains closed with a goal to start reopening in May. Reporting live in Oregon, Kaylee Marantet, WTOL 11.